double and triple team him every snap because nobody else is making plays. Well, it's off the edge. Michael Hoyt instead with Donald taking up a lot of the room inside. Can you get home and impact and affect the quarterback because it comes out so quickly? So here is Daryl Henderson, the former third-round pick of the Rams. He's back in the lineup, and he's into Steelers territory with a 16-yard run. Steelers bringing more pressure. Highsmith came around the edge, and Stafford goes down. Larry Ogunjobi ends up with the sack, his second of the year. But at least there was something positive there. They haven't made it to that level yet. Pickett under pressure, and he goes to Pickens. And Pickens goes into Rams territory. A pickup of 17. Rams bring just four on third and long. He wants Pickens. It is caught, but it's incomplete. Out of bounds. Did not corral it in bounds. To give to Freeman his first touch of the season, and he takes it for nine to set up a manageable third down and one. And the run game has to be more of a part of the offense for the Rams. You saw that the second half last week. Pressure from the Steelers. Stafford over the middle. Here comes Puka Nakua with a first down and a burst out to midfield. Here's Freeman. Has a hole up the gut. He slips one tackle and turns it into a first down to the 40. Well, they'll run it on third down and five, and Freeman gets hammered by Minka Fitzpatrick. Very solid overall in his career from beyond 50-plus. This is a 53-yarder. And it's off the upright. Yeah, yeah, that, that physique shows no, no laziness <laughs> whatsoever. Absolutely. Kenny Pickett, comeback route. It is snatched. In Rams territory for a first down by Deontay Johnson. Welcome back to one of the Steelers' best wide receivers. Aaron Donald still off the field. Pickett under pressure. Flag is thrown. He gets grabbed and wrapped up once again by Hoyt. But we'll have to check that marker as well from 53. The veteran kicker is true. It, it's not an easy thing to do to Montrevious Adams, and, and he was able to get upfield and disrupt that run play. Empty set, Stafford with five in the pattern. He's got Cooper Cup with space, and he taps the toes for a catch near midfield. How deep in the bag do you got to go for Sean McVay? Trying to call something here. It's going to go to the tight end, Bryson Hopkins, wrapped up by Keanu Neal and company. And that drive got completely shut down by the penalties. Pickett trying to scramble to the outside, and he'll have to float it away. Had to wait for the substitutions. Now Stafford off the deep drop. Wow, Puka Nakua is wide open inside the 30. This is where Nakua has dominated the middle of the field against zone. Four-man rush for Pittsburgh. Stafford on the slant for Nakua. It's incomplete. He's kind of taking the leash off now and says he can play every down for us moving forward. From 41, it's Maher. After missing from 53, makes a great kick to tie this game up at three apiece. Six to play, first half. Rams upset Seattle and beat Arizona so far for two of their wins. Oh, George Pickens back shoulder just snatches it in front of Witherspoon. Stafford on the cross. It's Nakua again. And a good block down the sideline by Tutu Atwell to open it up for more yardage. Check to the run. It's Henderson with a nice hole, and he surges forward. He's got it all the way down to the 36, about a half yard shy of the line to gain, seemingly. The hand was down out of bounds first. Would have been a 16-yard gain had he completed it. Stafford had to spin away from Highsmith. Throws on the run towards the end zone. Caught. Tutu Atwell. Touchdown. <laughs> oh, a little off target. Maher unable to connect his first miss PAT. Out of the empty set on first down. Stafford is picked up. It's T.J. Watt. A 
and he's down to the six-yard line. The Pittsburgh defense. Pickens to the left. Pickett to the right. Harris bobbled it, controlled it, stayed in bounds, hurdled his way, lost the ball. Is he going to be ruled down at the one? Seemingly yes. It's Pickett. It's a touchdown. Tie game. Off the fake. This is where Stafford's at his best. Play action. Nakua in traffic. And he made the catch. What a play by Puka Nakua. In between Wallace and Fitzpatrick somehow came down with it. It's the four-man rush. Stafford. And that crossing pattern in the middle of the field for Nakua is there. And he punches through two tackles to take it inside the 10. It's first. Second and goal. Pressure coming. Stafford, the screen against the blitz. It's Henderson. And he's down inside the one-yard line. Alex Highsmith saved the touchdown. Field and then dropping it and getting back. Tempo. Henderson. He's in to give the Rams the lead. Welcome back to Los Angeles, Daryl Henderson. Stafford looking, throwing, he's got cup, he's got the two, and the Rams have a seven-point lead. A fine 14. Pickett got away from 99 and Donald, but it ends up being a finish by Hoyt and Byron Young. The 29 Rams get a good run from Freeman, and he continues to push ahead. As he takes it out to the 44-yard line. Well, quick snap here to Stafford. Quick throw to the outside for Higby. And on national tight ends day, Higby is able to move the chains. Stafford looking. Being chased by T.J. Watt, turns the corner, and Stafford has the first down. Extra man coming for Pittsburgh. Stafford, tough throw on the move for Cup. 51-yard try, not even close. Well, they're 57 yards and an extra point away from tying this game. Pick it. He's got Deontay Johnson. With a move and a broken tackle into the red zone. On third and eight, a big gainer for Johnson. On second down, Warren looking for an alley. He's got the end zone, and the Steelers are an extra point away from tying it. We've seen this a lot before third and shorts. Stafford, Nakua, incomplete. And that time Joey Porter Jr., the fellow rookie, got the best of the matchup. First in Los Angeles in 30 years. They've got that look down the bottom again. Pickett's looking there for Pickens. Back shoulder executed to perfection in front of their old teammate, Akello Witherspoon. Double-digit back shoulder throws to Pickens. He can go a little bit less to that well with the addition of Johnson today. Here's Harris, big hole, and Najee Harris running with purpose, close to the line to gain. Blitz coming, picked up by Harris, pick it to the outside for Johnson. To the 19-yard line, into the red zone, go the Steelers. They just got the snap off, they got it to Harris, Pittsburgh's got the lead. Here is Freeman. Got tripped up, stayed on his feet, and turned it into a nine-yard gain. Third and long. Stafford throws it deep, and it's incomplete. Nakua was the closest man, and the ball was about 15 yards away. Three straight third down. Steeler stops. Four-man rush. Pickett deep down the middle for Pickens into Rams territory. 
New life for the Rams defense. Pick it. Trying to pick it apart. It is caught near the sticks. And Russ Yeast is able to hit Allen Robinson. It's Pickett, the sneak, and he looks to be short initially, but did he get that ball across the line to gain? My goodness, just past the line to gain. And the, the play by T.J. Watt to start the second half, the Rams get points at the end of the first half. They're poised to come out and kind of blow this game open. And T.J. Watt and the Steelers' defense were outstanding second half. The offense, typical fourth quarter. Kenny Pickett gets hot. And here we go.